Hello! Welcome back to my channel. This is the third vlog about Menorca and if you missed first two episodes you can check them out on my channel. So here I'm going to continue talking about activities and experiences that we had during our seven day vacation. So today we are going to a very special place and it's one of my favorite activities in the world. I love horses as in animals and I also have already tried horse riding a couple times. Also Menorca has their own horse breed, it's called Menorqui or Catalan and these horses are usually dark color and they are average height. And since 2007 they are endangered. Even though my husband and I are beginners in horse riding, we still decided to choose this longer excursion. But usually they advise to, uh, for the beginners, the smaller one, which is about one hour or one hour and a half. And we were riding for about two hours and 30 minutes. So it was pretty long. But I absolutely loved it because we were going through some natural reserves and most of our path was private area so you can't really go there. So we were going up and down through some mountains to the Fastum Cove where there is actually the only one beach where the horses are allowed to swim on the island. Because of the seaweeds, we couldn't swim with the horses, which we were kind of really upset about. But still, it was great. I definitely say that this was the highlight of my vacation to Menorca. very next day we decided that the other way to explore the island is actually going for a hike so around the island there is this ancient route that's called Kamedu Kaval and it's a route historically it was a route for horses to go around the island but through this route it's actually the best way to get to the wild beaches and we chose the one that start off from the closest beach to us and it was a three hour hike and uh, we thought well maybe we can try <laughs> we definitely didn't have good enough shoes for it but uh, and we also didn't plan on the water so our water we drank almost all our water on the half so we aren't really prepared for hiking. we weren't really prepared for hiking and the road was really going up and down so you go up the hill you go down the hill you go up the hill you go down so we were really really tired because we didn't have enough we didn't take enough water for us both for three hour hike and then it was also really really hot but uh, the nature again so beautiful such a beautiful island and i was really amazed by the nature and the wildlife how it is preserved on the island and so definitely yes the only thing that if you want to go on a hike then it's uh, you better get ready and have more comfortable shoes and have enough water and don't do it the way we did it but I still think that it was really worth it even though we were super tired and super thirsty till the end of our hike but still so beautiful and so amazing to see the nature this is the reason why people come to Menorca to see all of it We 
did it. <sighs> the first thing we did was of course buying two bottles of water because we were extremely thirsty. But then we were ready to swim and enjoy this beautiful water. It was different from our beach because our beach was a lagoon and this was a long side coast beach so but still it was really beautiful the water was warm and it also was a windy day so we had some little waves Hope you enjoyed the video. See you in the next and last fourth episode about Menorca soon on my YouTube.